look out my window. Hello, traders. Gary Wagner with WFGForex.com, your daily market update for Forex Gold. It is the first day of the week in Australia, Monday. Here, Sunday in Honolulu, gold has just opened, and this is the daily report for June 13th, 2010. We are looking at a 15-minute candlestick chart. As you see the open of gold, gold is currently trading at 1230.85. So we've had a slightly higher open. I'm going to circle the activity of the day. Of course, the market opened and, excuse me, closed right in this area. And we have had a gap to the upside as the market opened this morning, Monday morning in Australia. As you can see, almost a linear move straight up. It has slowed down just a little bit. And in today's report, we're going to take a look at what we're looking in for the week ahead, uh, as well as positions that we've taken on. Of course, as you remember, I did recommend that we go in and purchase gold on the close. Traders who got in should have got in somewhere around 1227. The market had some wild gyrations at the close. So you could have gotten in much better, actually. Stops at 1208. Uh, this, of course, is our classic daily chart. And as you can see, uh, this candle here, this red candle, is the indication or today's activity. What the Forex does is it does continue uh, to create this candle, and it will create this candle up until the open in New York so we've got a little bit more ways this candle should actually be a little bit longer as you see it should be right up here let me try to draw it in for you people well actually they've just gone and updated the chart so what we originally saw as a piercing line is now become in a golfing bullish that's of course if it maintains and continues to trade like this as you can see this candle has in fact moved up and begun to engulf the prior state candle, currently trading at 123085, roughly 1231 an ounce. The market does want to move higher at this point. Now we've gone to a one minute chart. As you can see, this is kind of the activity that we witnessed. When the market opened up this morning, what it did was it actually traded a little bit lower. Uh, on the open for the first couple of minutes and then within five minutes really started to take off it uh, went straight up as high as about 131 that's right in this area here and is now trading just within this little channel here and when it trades within a channel like that what it's doing is is kind of consolidating and we'll get an idea whether they're going to want to a pull profits from this move find a base and then move back up if in fact it's going to remain bullish or if it's simply going to be another breakout to the upside. Now I've taken it back down to a four hour candlestick chart because in that way we get a little bit more indication. Each candlestick roughly, roughly represents a half a day's worth of trading. What you can see in here is, of course, as this market went and took and created this record top, it wasn't on a closing basis at 1251. Of course, that's the new historical high. It immediately, immediately sold off. Then what it did when it sold off, it looked like it formed a base or a bottom here at 1215. And from there, we got a what I'll call an on neck pattern. An on neck pattern is after a defined down, downtrend, you have a candlestick, a red candlestick, which opens, of course, always at the close on a forex and closes below the midpoint. So it is the opposite of what we'll call a piercing line. And we did get confirmation, although it was a small, small red body candle on the following day. However, at this point, we have seen continuation of the marketplace moving back up. On this report, I simply wanted to talk about the open. We will possibly do another report later on as the market has some time under its belt. But I did want to update traders who took the call exactly where the open of this market was. This has been Gary Wagner with WFGForex.com, your daily market update, wishing you, as always, good trading. Bye-bye.